Patty Chesney, it ain't back yet on 103.5 WEZL. It's 812, 12 minutes after. Ladies and gentlemen, here she is back in her uh, accustomed blue. <laughs> my Mother's Day present from my daughter. Is that right? Oh, nice. yes. Did she make that? No. Oh, okay, because I started to say she did a nice job. She, she went to the store and bought it. Nice stuff. Thank nice you. stuff. Uh, and you, and you've got a, a case here from That's the uh, yeah. Yeah, case That's here K. from the Charleston Animal Society. And she has Tonka. Tonka truck. He's here today, Ooh, buddy. He's boy. solid. He's awesome. I, I I was talking to Zoe on the way in, and she said, "Who are you taking?" And I said, "Tonka." She said, "It's a big dog, right?" <laughs> yes, <laughs> yes. She she knows. Knows. Yeah. Mm, he's thick. <laughs> he is thick. What he's, is he? I I can't quite nail nail that. What is he's he? He's about. 58 pounds, I think, is what they said. Probably 60 now. He's solid, too, he's, let me tell you. I think he's a lemon walker because he's kind of cream-colored with those big beige spots on him. Mm -hmm. But his head looks like a Staffordshire Terrier. Mm -hmm. So, But he's a good mix. He's not, you know, he doesn't look as so much as like a pit bull as he does like a hound. I got you. Very but he's friendly. got the turtle head. Yeah. yeah. Kind of like Rick. He's a big boy. Yeah. But yeah. you know what? His his coat is just as soft as you could as you could, would ever feel. Yeah. He's oh, a good boy. So sweet. And staff loves him. They begged me to bring him on the show yeah. today because they knew that it would help him he to get adopted. Great, great and he's dog. got those uh, happy go lucky floppy ears on him. You know, they just kinda stand up and then fall over. He's yeah. he's He's really a cool dog. And he all he wants you to do is pet him. I mean, yeah. I was over there petting him a little while ago, and I mean, when I stopped, hey, he buddy. says, uh-uh, you're not finished yet. Yeah, <laughs> he grabs at your hand, and he no, does no commands. He will sit. Yes. He will stop when you yeah. tell him to stop. But he's going to need some training, so we're, we're, you know, he'll be able to take advantage of that $84 uh, the 15% discount at our canine college, yeah. which starts tomorrow night. Canine college starts tomorrow night. So check our website at charlestonanimalsociety.org if you need to um, train your dog or if you want to check out that um, the psychic or the dog um, communicator that will be coming to uh, the well, you training know what? classes. I was all over that, but I got a ball game that day. And I told uh, my wife, I says, I can't go. I got a ball game. Yeah. But I saw that on the canine college. Yeah, said, That's it's going to be cool. We're really You have a dog psychic? She's a canine communicator. A canine communicator. I would just like to go hear what she has to say. Yeah, About what? Too. Now, what did, does, well, she, does she look at you and tell no, you what your dog's thinking or what? You know, I don't know. I wanted to go see and see exactly what she talks about. She and tells it's people. It's very what, interesting. She'll tell people. A lot of times I've heard that she tells people things that the dog's been through mm -hmm. or um, it's, it's fears. I can do that. Any way to verify that? Yeah, I mean, I can do that. <laughs> Because I can do that. That paying, dog there, that paying, dog right there, he's afraid of women in, in purple. And he's hungry. <laughs> and he's, he, ate, he ate a raw steak one time out behind the Outback Steakhouse. Stop it now. Huh, what? I can you, tell. Let me ask you this, Kay. Are you paying people for this? Because I could use some extra money. <laughs> he needs to buy Bradley a bicycle. No, really. Seriously, the class is awesome. I'm mm. looking forward to it. He's by Bradley at Hey, let me tell you, I'll tell you what. Tell you what he's thinking right now. I like the way I taste. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> you know, we went off on this track the last time and it got ugly. Okay. So let's stop right let's now. Let's just stop we right just now. We need to get back to Tonka and <laughs> yes, give him a home. That's Tonka right. Tonka needs a home. And Tonka, now, am I to assume he was a stray? He was. Believe it or not, he was a stray off the streets. Came into the Charleston Animal Society, met the criteria of our um, caninality um, test, which are very stringent mm -hmm. uh, to be able to go up on the floor. He has to be able to be good with other dogs. Caninality. Yes, yes. it's uh, actually scientifically um, done. Uh, staff has been trained to do it. Where the we have the first. Um, one of 50, only 50 people in the United States that are trained to do this testing. That sounds like that dating service. <laughs> what? That one where they do the 57 levels of, of caninality or whatever it is to it's, see if it, if you match up. I think it's more like Garanimals. Garanimals. Oh, I got you. Okay. You know, it matches I got you. you up. But, cool. Um, so he had to pass all that. Then he got sick. He um, ended up being in kennel cough, so he yeah. had to go in the back again. Then he came back out, and our um, trainers have been working with him. He knows sit. He knows commands. He does stop um, when you when he starts to do something that you don't like, and you tell him to. He'll stop. He's been scratching a little bit today, that's, which that's, is bothering that's me. Rick at the door. It'll. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> but um, I think he's his skin is a little bit dry. He probably could use a good um, soothing oatmeal bath. That's what I was thinking. Oh, yeah. 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 That mm -hmm. sounds delightful. Mm -hmm. Put cucumbers on his eyes and be. <laughs>
<laughs> and a bunch of mud on his ask muzzle. Him, <laughs> ask him how he's feeling. Yeah, exactly. Have a communicator. Tell him that you worry. Don't yeah. let these people bug you like that. You're doing fine. You're you going to get home. I think it's funny, but I massage my dog. The puppies that I had, the, um, the um, foster puppies, I massage their paws and I massage their legs and their back so that they get used to that touch and that they're not um, upset. And they love it. They'll sure. Rick, Rick used to pay a paws. woman to do that until <laughs> until they got married. <laughs> they hold their paws up and I they love it. I think they that time, wasn't it? Yeah. <laughs> he called it a pedicure. I remember I was itching. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> called it a pedicure. Oh, y'all always digress. Ton- Tonka is a good dog. Tonka is, is a, a good dog. He's a Please. wonderful dog. He's having a good time. If Tonka. you want to see him, check him out online. We'll have him on the web here shortly. You can watch the video of Tonka scratching and stuff. <laughs> And licking my feet. Right and, licking, and licking Rick's feet. He's giving you that pedicure you love. That's right. If you need more details, you can always check them online. CharlestonAnimalSociety.org. And, Kay, we apologize for the insanity. It's okay. All right. He's a good boy. He is a good boy. Yes, dog. he Let's is. Let's get him a home today. All right. It's uh, 817 at WEZ. <laughs> With First Citizen set to